Welcome everybody, Gaming Mike here, back in permadeath mode here on No Man's Sky. I haven't played for a couple days in permadeath. Now, if I remember correctly, we got the Spadonium we need from this planet, but there's one more creature on the list. One more. And I want to find it. This one. Rex Ruli, that's the crab type that was in the caves. Or was it in caves? Yeah, I think it was in caves. So that's what we're going to be working on today. Daniel Hipley, welcome. Joshua Acock, Tricky I Know, and Punchy's Tuxedo, nice to see you. Yeah, welcome everybody. Thanks for joining. That's what's on the agenda. We're going to find that, and then we head back to base with all that spadonium that we gathered. But we want to find this last animal for the planet. I think that will put us at... Seven? Nope, that'll put us at six. That'll be our sixth completed planet if we can find the last critter. But who knows... And I was starting to think it might be a storm or a nighttime animal, and this planet had some really nasty storms. And some little headbutters that I have to watch out for. Predators. It still could be a bird, too. It still could be a flying type. Nope, I thought that was a dot, but it's not. So how are we doing out here? It's hot. That's for sure. Let's charge up those grenades. Let's charge up that life support. Because we're going to run. And we're going to jetpack. What have we got there? Some Herox. And a Gek Charm. Green dots on the ridge. Green dots, green dots. Oh, finding the last animal. Such a beast sometimes. Such a beast. Hold on one second. There we go. Link 55. Link, welcome to the chat. <laughs> Whatever your numbers are. Thanks for joining us. Pallet PC, welcome as well. Nice to see you again. Back here where we left off last time. Looking for that last animal. Permadeath mode. Gotta be careful. Gotta be so careful. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, 5012. Link 5012. <laughs> Stumbled over it. Oh, I already opened these. Do I have shielding shards? I have nothing for my shielding. Uh oh. I should probably make a shielding shard if I can. Hooray. Oh, I just saw. Birds! There they are. That's it. It was a bird after all. Hooray! Hooray! Let's get a photo of them. Let's see what they look like. That was easy. Good. I was hoping that would happen. I was hoping I'd log in. It would be quickly, uh, pretty quick to find these. Whatever the last animal was. Two cans. Nice. Alright. That means we can leave this blasted planet. That's great. <laughs> Did a good job. I decided to stream right after you got up from your nap. Well, good, Josh. I'm glad the timing worked out on that. And I hope your nap was just swell. Welcome to the new viewers rolling in. Thanks for joining us here on Gaming Mike's channel. We found the last animal. It was a flying type after all. They finally spawned in. Did I already scan the carbon whips? I did. Get out of here. Oh, that's great. Let's go. Let's go before anything happens. <laughs> Gary Lyle, welcome, welcome. Discovery is a white dot? What do you mean? The white dots uh, for the scanning for animals. You can see here's a green dot right here. It's green. That means I've already discovered that creature. Off in the distance you can see all these white dots. That means those are creatures, but you can't tell if it's a green or a red dot yet. And if the dot is red, it means you have not found that creature before. So, see he's a green dot. Already discovered. That's how that works. Well done, thanks Pallet PC. Yeah, that's great. So, this planet was a ways off from where we need to go, like a minute flight. Remember we had our first pirate battle last time. And uh, came out of that okay. It was only one pirate. It was no big deal. Got the blood pumping though. Just 
is always nice. Oh yeah, we picked up that vortex cube while we were here. This planet has vortex cubes. And I pilfered that one and had to run away. <laughs> that was ridiculous. Uh, let's stock up on iron before we go for our pulse jet. We'll need to make sure to do that. Because how's that? Oh, it's empty. Oh yeah, gotta grab iron. Oh yeah. Oh, for sure. Oh, the storm's on. Great. Great. Oh, offline already. Oh, great. Oh, look out. Heat damage. How much iron was that? 15. Nothing. <laughs> Gotta shoot off Tricky right on. Thanks for stopping by. Appreciate you being here. We'll catch you later. Oh, the storm just had to roll in just now. What do you mean, not enough fuel in launch thruster? What? Yes, there is enough fuel in the launch. Oh, 99%. What? <laughs> Let's fly off. Look at this guy. So huge. Oh, good. My cockpit's all messed up. Great. Oh, anomaly detected when I scanned. Okay. Okay. Moving polos around? I didn't even know it. Oh, line it up there. Line it up there. How much iron? Oh, we didn't get much iron. How full is the pulse drive? Not very full. I don't care. <laughs> See? There you go. It's almost worth landing again just for the cockpit adjustment. I don't want to fight pirates like this either. If it comes to it. Oh, no free slots. Oh, for Thamian. Must be a lot of Thamian in these. I hope I'm not missing out on precious minerals. Discoveries a white dot. Push options. This dot? These dots? Those are the pages. Four pages. Oh, speaking of which. I really ought to upload those now. And get my units for finishing the discoveries list. There we go. Give me that money. I love it. Is that the white dots that you meant though, Daniel Hipley? The ones at the bottom of this thing? Into page four though, that's great. That's a lot of discoveries. And here we go, 250,000 units for that list. Boom. Broke a million. Excellent. Broke a million units. So great. Traitor. Nice. Compiler discovered all species on six planets. Uh oh. I didn't even see my scanner go. Approaching whom? Me? Nope, that's a space battle. Oh good, that means I can just uh, fly over to the... Yeah, I wasn't looking at my scanner, but if they're going to be busy with the freighters, that means my trip back to the planets is going to be uninhibited. <clears throat> so I'll take it. I'll take it. It's great. Miles says to Chin. Punchy says pirates. Yeah, did my scanner go off? I wasn't looking really, but I wasn't paying attention, I guess. I didn't see if it went. Technology 
I'll save the iron for now. Why not? Man, oh man. Creeping, creeping while I'm working, working. Welcome to it, Lazlo Ursus Audio. You're in your, uh, you're not in your Laz account. You're not on your Laz account. Super early stream today. Well, it's, you know, Memorial Day. I didn't have to go to work. Why not do some streaming? Why not? I'm gonna be doing Uncharted tonight, though. My regular stream time is Monday, Wednesday, Fridays at 9 p.m. Mountain Standard. That's about six and a half hours from now, wherever you are, if you're watching live. So uh, feel free to join me tonight for more Uncharted 3. I just, I've done a first play of that. I played it for a couple hours the other, last week. Uh, but I'll be doing more of that tonight. So if you're not already subscribed, hit that button and hit the bell so you get notified when I go live. And then you won't miss it. And then you won't miss a minute. Uncharted has been fun. I really enjoy that game, those games, the trilogy. Bought the remastered trilogy on PlayStation. Ten dollars says Nathan Drake dies tonight. You know he will. You know he's going to. I've got some fail compilation videos of all my deaths in those games so far. If you're interested in checking that out in the stream highlights playlist, feel free. Pretty entertaining. Lots of ways to die in those games. And it's always <laughs> it, it always makes me chuckle. the entrance to the anomaly. Oh, I thought I went around. Goodness. I'll just go around the slow and that's fine. The dark side of the anomaly. Seriously, where's the entrance? We got pirates coming again, crying out loud. That space battle didn't last long. Where is the entrance to the anomaly? What is going on here? Is this it? What the hell? What is going on with this thing? How do I get in? Moon Machine, welcome to it. Fabian Escobar, welcome, welcome. Also known as Many Deaths, Robert Miles, yeah. Uncharted, for sure. Okay, that is not the entrance. Anomaly's all locked up. What's going on? Beam, beam Impact Theta, Vortex Q times 3, Carbon. Okay, thanks, Daniel Hipley. I'll keep that in mind if I need to build Beam Impact Theta. What the hell is going on with this thing? Closed for the holiday for real. Captain Monday Baker, sir, we just finished the Spadonian planet, found all the animals on it, and left. There's a space battle going on in the system which allows us to travel without worrying about pirates for now, but I can't find my way into this space anomaly. Sir, welcome to the chat. There's your report. Alright, obviously not the entrance, right? That's not where you go in. Okay, I, I get that. Now let's go to the other side of it. Just want to find you. We're not quite to the other side yet. Fifty-one jumps away from the galactic hub. Nice, Captain Baker. Nice. Making way there. There it is. There's the entrance. Holy cow! Why am I having such trouble finding the entrance of the anomaly? It would help if the beacon for it wasn't in the dead center of the structure. So that it looks like you're headed towards it no matter which direction you approach from. Delay for you, Joshua. Yeah, sometimes you gotta refresh if YouTube buffers. If your live button on the video is not red, that means you're delayed. You can click the live button to catch it up, though, and it'll turn red. What do we have here? Singular 
Rusiakana. Rusiakana. A C class pistol? Tuh. Why, I think not, sir. Nada. Oh, it is a new visit. Good. Hello, Polo. I should rotate. That would make docking fun. Moon machine. Oof. That'd be <laughs> rough. Oh, I haven't destroyed level 3 or above pirates. Where am I? I think I've only destroyed one pirate, come to think of it. I'm going to have to work on that no matter what. Uh, destroyed two starships. Is that the one? Yeah, I need level 3. Five slots. Wow, yeah. Pathetic tool that they offered, isn't it? Please density nada. Physics simplistic. Uh, resources, please. Thank you. Oh, toxin suppressor, finally. Hooray. Thanks, Nada. Useful for once. Bye. Slacking. Yes, I'm slacking, Moon Machine. I haven't fought nearly enough pirates. Not nearly enough. What do you think? Should we go uh, see if that space battle's still going on and pick a few of them off? How are my shields? I need more iron for my close engines. I've got plenty of zinc and titanium for shields, though, right now. I don't think that space battle is still going. I don't see any markers for it. Estian Schumann, welcome to the chat. Just working on permadeath, man. Thanks for joining us. Hope your Monday's going well. Planet base detected. Yeah, that space battle is not still happening. God. Hesitant wait around for regular pirates. Yeah, I could do that too. Maybe in the uh, home base system. Hope for ones and twos. Yeah, for real. Oh, Moon Machine, somebody was saying that you knew a method of telling how many pirates would appear in a system. Uh, that you could tell how many there would be each time. Is that something that you know? Or does that sound familiar? Because, uh, tell me your secrets. <laughs> tell me your methods. <laughs> and welcome to the new viewers rolling in. Wow, I didn't see the number jump up like that. Thanks for joining us here on Gaming Mike's channel. Appreciate you guys being along. Don't forget to hit that like button if you're digging the No Man's Sky stream this afternoon. Just working my way through permadeath. The goal is the center, eventually... What you got? Starship inventory. Where's that Herox? What? Yeah, Herox. Right there. And Vortex Cube. Right? You haven't noticed the pattern, Moon Machine? Okay, never mind then. Sell items. Vortex cubes are at a good price here. That's great. The Herox isn't, but who cares? <laughs> Get it out of here. And I've got some Gek charms for you fellas. Heck yes, I do. He's the farmer. Not him. Metal Cup. Hireling Metal Cup. He's Metal Cup. <laughs> The life form is pouring over complex starship schematics and holding its breath, but the holographic blueprints look corrupted, damaged, in flight perhaps. The forlorn traitor, its face smudged by atmospheric dust that somehow breached its ship, looks up to me for help. Despair, friend, something, 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 something. Ooh. Deflector shield. I have an upgraded deflector shield. Phase beam, pulse engine. You want deflector shield because your ship was breached. Ah, ha, ha. Overjoyed traitor gabbles its thanks and excitedly hands me a gift. New technology, cannon damage, Sigma, nice. Ooh, I can upgrade my photon cannons with more iron. 
That's easy. There may be factors you haven't considered. I know if it spawns four at a time, it will generally continue to do so. If it spawns low numbers, that will continue. But if you leave and return, that can change. Okay, Moon Machine. So it's kind of like a random setting every time you go to a system. Is what it sounds like. But this system only showed me one pirate, so this would be a good place to get into the fights. It wouldn't it, it wouldn't it be? Wouldn't it be? Would it not be? Oh, hold on. Before I do that, gotta give you these charms. There you go. Ah, ha, ha, ha. He loves it. Standing increase. Ah, ha, ha, ha. He, he, he. he loves it. One more. One more, buddy. Let's get that standing up. There we go. These Gek love me. What do you have? I forget. And I don't have many nanites in permadeath. Nope, 46. 46. And I've got some trophium to sell. Mine asteroid waits for pirates and bounties. Yeah, Punchy's Tuxedo, that's kind of what I'm thinking. Maybe we'll do a little bit of pirate fighting today. Sell. Oh, it's in my starship. Trophium. Sell it. Oh, it's a good price here. That's good. Your friend said there's no base building in freighters, Joshua? Wow. I'm going to have to play it again. Yeah, a lot of people uh, just ignored it after a while. I'm a collaborator. Bounties can be tough if you don't have upgrades, Moon Machine. I have one shield upgrade, and if I blast a little bit of iron, I'm going to build this cannon upgrade, too. I'm going to build a cannon upgrade. But I have the plus two shield. That's pretty good. This is only the plus one damage. So yeah, let's go blast some iron, build a cannon, fight some pirates, shall we? Make sure you got at least 1,000 iron. Oh, I am low on iron, but I've got titanium and zinc I can use for shielding in my ship. Easily enough. Show me some asteroids over there. Photon cannons, purple, putting that upgrade on. That's nice. That's a nice change. Oh, they're overheating a lot faster. You gotta watch that. You gotta go back to tapping. The tappy method. Here, pirate, pirate, pirate. I'm just wondering if that space battle messed it up because even after that space battle happened, the pirate scanner went off again. And then no pirates showed up. So I'm wondering, because I think after the space battles, they just stopped coming. I don't know. I can't confirm that. But it seems like this has happened before as well. Where pirates just stopped showing up after space battles. Even when the battle's done. We'll see. We'll give it a minute. I need to collect some stuff anyway. Yeah, maybe in it. That sure is your name backwards. That sure is. Used to roll with 500 doing Rasamama Supreme. You got in the habit of a thousand plus iron for shields alone, Moon Machine. That's a lot of iron. That was probably a bounty. I didn't see anything pop up for the bounty, though. Wow. Oh, there's 
that iridium chunk. <laughs> yeah, see, nothing's happening on that pirate scanner still. And it's all bl it's blinking like it already went off. I'm probably going to have to leave this system. But that's fine. We can head back to base, dump this spadonium, get some spadonium growing, which is why we came here in the first place. It was all for the spadonium. Yeah, let's do that. Because I don't think the pirates are going to come. Until I leave. Oh, I'm too close to the space station. Oh, really? Oh, speaking of which, what do we have here? Oh, we've got a number three. There's a number three system. I mean, station. Sometimes the space battle pirates hang around in the system. If they don't die, that may interfere with spawns. Yeah, something like that, Moon Machine, is what I'm thinking. Some kind of glitch in that battle system. I've noticed it before, though. They'll show eventually, says Punchies. There it is. There what is? Did you see the orange trail? No, I didn't. Oh. You saw the pirates? I'll go hunt them down. But I don't know where you were looking. Hold on. Let me get back out away from the station. Was it when I was flying towards it? I see a blue trail. I forgot to look for orange trails. I see freighters there. There should be orange dots on the radar too, right? Oh, yeah, right there. That means they're... Out that way somewhere. Is there anything going on with the numbers on the building link? Uh, no definitive conclusions from the data yet. But that's normal mode. This is permadeath. Orange small diamond on center console. Yeah. I'm looking for the trails. Oh, there's three blue. You getting chased? Oh, probably over by those freighters way out by the planet where that space battle happened, huh? <coughs> The Tay X. People are still playing this. No. Nobody plays this. The Tay X. It's incredible. Treasure. Nybaf. Ross. Rabosco. Rabosk. Is there any mass lawsuit against the B-Tray? I want my money back. Wow, the Tay. You're about like nine months late on that argument, bud. Thanks for joining the chat, though. Uh, I can't believe you're still looking for a refund. Okay, uh, good luck. <laughs> good luck to you. <laughs> Class action, finally. Oh, the Tay. The Tay, there's a video in my stream highlights playlist that you should check out. <laughs> I don't see the orange trails. How far out there do you think they are? You said you saw the orange trails, Moon Machine, or were you talking about the dots? seeing them. But we'll put them right in our radar sights and blast a little further. A little bit of the old system exploration. We're closer to planet. Which planet? That's them. That's them right there. Is it? I don't know. The Beatles are partly responsible for the fall of communism. Wow, Lete. If you have the game, I wouldn't try to get my money back at this point. I wouldn't buy it for full price, says Link. Well, I never regretted paying full price for it once. It passed me. It probably despawned, says Moon Machine. Oh, well. I'm thinking I'm seeing an orange glow out this way, but I can't sure yet. Yeah, I think these are three orange trails, actually, maybe. They're just to the right of my center. Coming up on it. Those are freighters, maybe? I don't know what that is. And... Nope, oh, that's three. That's three orange. Oh, that's a lot of orange. Oh my goodness. That's a lot of orange, y'all. Or are those freighters? Those aren't trails. Those are freighters. What are those? Whoops. Nope. Those are orange trails. 
Yeah, those are the those are the pirates. They must have taken out the freighters, and now they're just flying what towards the station to cause more trouble. If I come up on these, and can I still fight them two at a time? Moon machine, if you could let me know, that'd be great. I think I can still fight them two at a time. Where'd they go? Oh, I lost them in the sunlight. I lost them in the sunlight. I had to say the orange trails are left by S-Class ships. Doomtooth Gosnell. I don't believe that's accurate. I believe the orange trails are left by pirates. That's what I believe. Where are they? There. Nope, that's an asteroid. Nope. There's the dots. Really hard to see orange trails on this orange background. Oh, there they go. There they go. They slow poke around the system. Not sure what happens if I engage. Well, when you're doing a freighter battle, one of those space battles, they only attack, I think, two at a time if you attack them in pairs, right? That seems to be what I've noticed. I don't know if that's for sure or not, and I certainly don't want to pick a fight with five, do I? I have a lot of shielding, uh, zinc and titanium. I have a lot of zinc and titanium. Here he is. I could probably take this one out before the others turn around, but four? Oof. Four? <laughs> I'm feeling a little reckless right now, I gotta be honest. I am feeling a little bit reckless. Well, did he just shoot at an asteroid? Is he shooting at asteroids? Look at him. He's pretty far behind the others, too. To hell with it. Oh, kind of tough. Oh. There. And the others, are they attacking? Are they after me? Can I get that loot ski? I missed it. Is my inventory full? It is. I want that loot. Lemium. No guts, no glory. That's right, Robert Miles. Okay, the others didn't seem to care. Yeah, I think they come in packs of two. And I think probably his partner was already dead. I would guess they still have wingman protocols, but you don't know. Yeah, I think they, I think, there's always six that attack freighters, right? And I think they come in three pairs of two, and I think if you only attack a pair, the others will leave you alone. But if you accidentally attack, like, one from two different pairs, then you'll have two pairs on you. Or three. Uh, let's see. Let's see. So where are those others? Let's go after them. Because I needed a few more pirates anyway for my milestone. I didn't mean the ones directly from the engines, the red lines that come from planets that lead to the space station. Oh, the trade lines? There are red trade lines? I've never noticed that. I've never noticed a red trade line. Let's restock a little bit. Let's see, how's the zinc and titanium? We're down to 374 zinc, still 500 titanium now. That's a lot. Punches says I need more fuel. Oh, warping battles have nine moon machine? I didn't know that. That's cool. That works. Need to go cook BRB. Okay, Link. Welcome to the new viewers joining us here today for No Man's Sky Permadeath. Hope you guys are digging it here on Gaming Mike's channel. I'm finally, I'm finally seeing the Moon Machine way. I finally understand. Uh, Polo stopped by this system in his anomaly and said he wanted pirate data. And we had our first pirate battle in the last stream. And I killed that pirate. And then I just killed another one. And now, 
I'm starting to feel a little hungry. A little hungry. We've got Pirate Scanner going off, though. Let's see what that does. I think I'm catching up to these guys, too. I think that's their trail. So maybe I should hold off until I'm sure that some more pirates aren't going to pop out right in front of me. Yeah? Let's make sure. Don't be hasty, Master Mariadoc. And the pirate scanner went off and nothing happened. Because these guys are still kicking around. <clears throat> Am I going to warp after the anomaly? Uh, Punchies, I'll be going back to the base system after I get this pirate stuff for the anomaly and talk to Polo. Because I've got a load of spadonium to go plant. A load of spado. Load of spado. Oh, here. Look. This pair. I can't tell if those are orange trails or blue. Those are pretty orange looking. I don't know. This orange sky is messing me up. Oh, and my steering is horrible. So these pirates, they don't mess with you unless you mess with them. Yeah, orange trails. We got four. Four bogeys. At three o'clock. Punchy says engage. <laughs> Warp in there are one or two groups of three. Okay. I got your moon machine. I'm gonna go for the guy in the back. That's me. That's them. Well, what do you say, pilgrim? You wanna get into a fight today? Oh. Take that. He's got the lasers. Oh, where'd he go? Alright, alright. Anybody else? Or was that it? Oh, can I pick them off one at a time like this? That'd be great. Oh, if I can just pick them off one at a time. Oh, we'll have a lovely little time. But where'd the others go? I'm the pirate stalker. Looking for trails. The sun being directly ahead does not help. With its oranginess. Where'd you go, pirates? It's fine. Oh, the Tay. The Tay, the Tay. No, you weren't muted, but you've earned it now. See ya. <laughs> Oh, the dots, they're just below me now. It looks like I've just flown past them. Let's see. That's me. Oh, there they are. Gar, directly below. Dive, dive. Oh, <laughs> too far. Come on, you crappy little ship. See you, pirates. Oh, this is fun. I should have been fighting pirates this whole time. It took me 27 or 28 streams to, uh, to finally fight them. And now I love it. Hey, buddy. Yeah, they just shoot at the asteroids a little bit. Whoops. Oh, not yet, not yet. I'm not ready to engage. Where is he? Asteroid. Did 
Did he get away? Did I miss him? There he is. There he is. Now he sees me. I see you, sir. Oh, I missed. Oh, no, where to go? There we go. Nice. Oh, uh, that's enough for Polo. No, that's enough for my next milestone. Let's see, where are they? Up this way. Journey milestone accomplished. Fighting pirates. Scrapper. Destroyed five. I think that's the level two, though. Oh, I, I didn't count the stars just now. I should have. Um, I think that was level two. Let's find out. Scrapper. Five. Yep, that's level two. Polo wanted level three. Is there a way to get a hold of a sentinel ship? That'd be cool, punchies. Nice work. Thank you, Moon Machine. High praise from the master. Everything I know, Moon Machine, I learned from you. These two are going to come as a pair. These two are going to fight together. I have a feeling. Look at the way they've stuck together this whole time. Oh, they're, they're branching off. Hold on. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> That's clumsy ass shit. <laughs> oh, I missed. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, that was quick. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right there, buddy. Right there, buddy. Right there, buddy. Right there, buddy. Your loot. Got that trophy. On. One more. He didn't attack. They didn't attack in a pair. It looked like they split off there right after I said that. It's fine by me. Yeah, he didn't even get me on that second pass by. He didn't have time. He was too busy being shot out of the sky. Down there somewhere? Where is he? Impossible to see in the sunlight. Impossible to find with my eyes. I have to use my radar and instincts. And maybe some photo mode. Oh, there he is. He's right there. High five's just a few more. Yeah, moon machine. How many was it to, uh... Four more. Four more. So I'll kill this guy and then I'd need three more waves. I've got the resources, the shield recharge resources to get that many. So we're going for it. Let's please Polo. Let's please Polo in this Spadonium system. Oh, hey guy. Where's your horses? Don't leave me. Haha, <laughs> gotcha. I got him. I got him. There we go, there we go. No, I missed. I wanted to finish him before he turned around. There he goes. Boom. So now I'm guessing that the pirates will start respawning in the system as well. Charge that shield. There's another diamond over there. There's another diamond this way. Hold up now. Is there another pirate left in the system? find out. I learned from watching you. That's right, Laz. <laughs> when they run, clearly it's every man for himself. Yes. Like Spike for the Pirate Slayer. Thanks, Pallet PC. Yeah, welcome to the new uh, new viewers joining the stream. Appreciate you guys coming along on Gaming Mike's channel today. Finally fighting pirates in karma death mode. I finally got up the courage, y'all. Finally. Moon Machine is a, a huge influence on me. I passed it past this diamond. Yar. I'll be fighting you out of the skies. Uh, 
Yeah, he's getting closer. This is actually helping me figure out how to read this radar once and for all, too. I sort of get it. The horizon on it is a little weird to me, but I'm seeing how it works better by doing this. We're catching up to this guy, if I'm reading it correctly. Yeah, now he's going to be right below me. The open window, welcome to it. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for saying hello in the chat. Where's the pirate? Now I'm right on top of him. Ah! Yar. Where are they? Oh, nope, that's a star. That's a star streak, not a ship streak. Better keep going. Like in the gung-ho spirit moon machine? Heck yes. I'm really enjoying it now that I'm getting into it. Track. I'm trying to keep him in the center of my radar there. Oh, excuse me, asteroid. Pirate scanner's going off again. guy's still here that maybe it's not going to let him spawn in. I don't know. Asteroid fields. Yep. Pirate scanner stopped going. No, no new pirates. Oh no. Where is he? Angle this way, he's right on me. So what is it? Uh, maybe. Oh no, not not galaxy map. A break from the ground pounding. Yeah, for sure, Moon Machine. A nice break from it. Towards the sun. And that line that's coming off of them. Hmm. Alright, it seems to be heading towards the sun. Yeah, it looks that way, punchies. We'll find him. We'll find him. It's all good. Anything on a system scan? Nah. This old shuttle's not too bad, really, now that I've taken it into battle a little. See, now he seems to be... I think I passed him. Hmm. Zimmer, welcome to it. Thanks for joining us. Glad to see you. Can he be now? Yeah, I need to get better at reading this radar for sure. If I'm going to be a pirate hunter. Wait, wait, wait. That line inverted. No, it just disappeared off the top. That means go up. You want it in that X right there? Is that the sweet spot? Oh, there he is. Oh, I get it. <laughs> Man, I get it again. I get I get even more about how it works now. I get it. That X, that those two lines arching up above. 
That's dead ahead. Put it in the X, and there he is. X on the radar. He's in the center of my my cursor. Okay. Line him up and nose down until the line vanishes. He is ahead. Yep. Thanks, Moon Machine. Just trying to figure out. I mean, I've never I've never tried to read that radar this specifically. I've always just used it as a general guide to know which direction to go. But I'm usually looking for planets, not pirates. It's a lot more fine-tuned this way. There he is, though. Let's get him. Let's get him. He's going the other way. There he is. Ready to engage. Don't. Don't. Fly over him. There he goes. Just flew past me. Right down this way. Oh, look out for asteroids. There he goes. There he goes. Oh, it's getting tricky. Oh, he's getting tricky. Oh, goodness sakes. There he is. There he is. Oh, he got away. He's out of range. Get him, get him. Here he, com here he comes. Oh, no photon cannons. Oh, got him before the first pass. Excellent. Oh, where does debris go? Where does debris go? There it is. That's the other thing. That debris is kind of hard to track down sometimes. Which I guess is part of the challenge. There we go. System cleared. I don't see any more diamonds now. Let's head towards the station. Excellent. Excellent. Not quite enough for Polo yet. How many more? Two more. Two more pirates will get me that milestone that I need. Nice. Nice. Loving it. Use the brakes to drift, punchies? Is that for real? Come on. Let's try some maneuvering here. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. So I had never tried that. Oh, okay. Dang, dang, dang. Some maneuvering. So if you can... I'm holding R2 and circle. Both of my engine buttons. But then if you... Look, at this is a regular turn like that. Real slow. Real slow. But look put on the brakes and turn. Okay, that's a lot faster. That's so great. Did not know you could do that. I bet the fighter ships are real good with that, aren't they? I bet the fighter ships are real fun to do that in. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna get into space combat, y'all. <laughs> Something I haven't done much in this game is the space combat. So, uh, it's probably about time. It's probably about time. the only way to find them. Yeah, that's really helpful. We had to learn to use the radar in combat and hubless moon machine? Yeah, I bet. It makes maneuvering a breeze. Yeah, punches. That really changes the uh, maneuverability. In your class A, it makes clean turns. Nice. Nice. Friggin' space combat time. <laughs> It's only been nine months. Maybe I should try to play this game. You spoke of it in your videos, Moon Machine. Yeah, I, I guess maybe I didn't pick it up if you mentioned it. It must not have registered. But it's different when you do it hands-on. It's different when you do things hands-on like that. I don't know why I'm coming in here. I need to be out there waiting for the pirate scanner to go off. Let's go harvest some iron. Good point to save it, though, just in case of any crashes or anything stupid. I could just destroy traitors, too, though, right? For this milestone? But then I'll get the sentinels on me if I'm destroying traitors. I don't need to mess with that right now. No, sir. No, sir. Let's find some asteroids. Oh, here they come. Oh, pirates. Let's go. 
Mm, now I'm excited. <laughs> ah. <laughs> and pirates. Oh, it's a bounty. Ooh. I've got a shield upgrade and a blaster upgrade, Moon Machine. You think I could take a bounty? It's a hundred thousand. That's the lowest, right? Experience is the best teacher, yes. There he goes. I'm feeling frisky. I've never done a bounty at all, not even in the other modes. It's only a one star. What do you think, Moon Machine? Could I do it? Nof Ghost, welcome to the chat. Multi asteroid drifting, yeah. <laughs> Just learning how to drift in this game. Kind of crazy. Been playing it since launch, never bothered much with space battles. Well, I've done it. Oh, yeah, he's strong. Oh, yeah, he's strong. Where is he? Come on, you punk. There it is. There it is, the moon machine maneuver. The moon, the maneuver. Where you drop in behind him and put him on the run. I didn't mean to scan. Oh, I'll put him on the run. So they can't double back on you. That's it. This is the first time I've really tried that, though. And it's working. Oh, it's working, baby. There he is. Oh, Moon Machine. Genius. Just a quick reminder. If you guys have not watched Moon Machine's master course on pirate fighting in No Man's Sky, definitely check it out. It's the only reason I was able to get that bounty just now. Plus, that's 100 grand. Oh, baby. I'm a pirate fighter now, y'all. <laughs> I'm a friggin' pirate fighter now. Screw it. I'm never landing on a planet again. <laughs> That's not true. I will. Oh, man. Yeah, I still need to get back to home planet, but we got, what, one more pirate now? We need to fight one more pirate, and then I'll be good. Moon Machine said he wouldn't do that with a lot to lose. Moon Machine, that actually makes me feel even better. Even better right now. So I hopped in here. I was thinking last time, right after I left the space station, the pirate scanner went off. I'm hoping that happens again. That's why I popped in here really quick. Chromium, Thamium, get out of there. Free up my inventory. My shields are charged. Let's... Whoa, look out now. <laughs> that guy scared the bejeebers out of me. Let's go innocently mine asteroids. I hope no pirates attack me. Blah. <laughs> you like that? Don't forget to hit that like button, y'all, for finally having the courage to face pirates in permadeath mode. Boy, it's liberating. Holy cow, I feel like master of the galaxy right now. That was with one cannon upgrade and one shield upgrade. That guy was not too hard. He didn't... He drained my shields on his first pass, but I made sure not to let him get another turnaround on me, and that seemed to work real well. That's it. That's all it takes. Yeah, that moon machine maneuver. It's the moon maneuver. It's the moon maneuver. The moon maneuver is key. Especially when you're only against one pirate. Yeah, forget about it. They're done. They're done if you tuck in behind them like that. It was the drifting that made me think to do that, actually. Practicing that drifting, I was like, oh yeah, that's probably how you do the moon maneuver. And sure enough, <laughs> now it all clicks. It all clicks. Once I finally try it, moon machine, I watched those videos that you did. But now that I've finally tried it, it's all clicking into place, you know, as it goes when learning things. Very, very, very helpful. Oh, that's going to, I mean, these minute long jumps to the distant planet in the system aren't going to seem so bad anymore. And that right there is some freedom. Give me my last pirate, though. I want to go. Come on, let's go. Give it to me. I got to talk to Polo, y'all. Bring me the pirates. Just so everybody knows, the Moon Nuver is the official name for it. We're always going to remember what the Moon Machine taught us. <laughs> there they come. Yeah. Come on, you pirates. I'm ready. So ready. I'm going to head towards the anomaly so I can fly in there as soon as this is done. I'm going to try not to shoot the anomaly because that'd be foolish. Hostile scans. Let's see if it's one or more. What's it going to be? Pirates. 
Ah, they found me cargo. Huh? She says ships. Oh! Oh, they're already here. Oh, son of a bee. They snuck up on me. I was, I was thinking they'd pop out in front of me. Was that two ships that flew by? I think it might have been. Oh, get back here. Get back here. Drift it. Drift it. Nice. There it is. There is another. Nope, there's not another. Where's his... Where's his... Loot. Where'd he go? Oh, no. I lost the loot. I got all turned around. Milestone accomplished, though. Now Polo wants to see me. Where does loot go? Oh, I'm... Well, I'm gonna call that a loss. Nuisance. Ten starships destroyed. Let's go talk to Polo. Now it's time. Been maneuvering, moon maneuvering before it was cool, yo, punchies. Well, good. I'm still giving all the credit to Moon Machine. Why you not build that Exocraft terminal yet, Edward G. Young? I'm not even on a planet, man. Lay off me. Welcome to the chat. Thanks for joining us. <laughs> Hadn't gauged the strength of bounty since Ross and Mama, but I know you shouldn't touch them without upgrades. Yeah, probably not, huh? Good advice. You'll be dropping out of warp before reaching a destination just for the encounters now. <laughs> Uh-oh, I've got the FIBA. The only cure. It's more space battle. Boy, I really cruised around that anomaly further than I meant to. I was looking at the chat while I flew. Polo, Polo, what have you got for me? I've killed your pirates, sir. Three milestones deep. Polo is a geck. Yes. Yes, son. Polo is a geck. And never trust a geck, son. Because you can't trust them. They're the first spawn. They give you what? Well, yeah, Polo does. But that doesn't mean you should trust him. Just take his gifts. <laughs> what if they're Pokemon cards? I don't know. I don't even know what I'd do if he gave you Pokemon cards. I don't know. What if? Polo, Polo. Right on, Moon Machine. Thanks for coming by. We'll see you later. Appreciate you being here. Bye-bye. Transmit pirate data. Heck yes. Nice, the homing grenade upgrade. Thanks, Polo. Thanks, buddy. Glad to be killing pirates for you. Glad to be on the payroll. And just because I accepted the gift doesn't mean I trust him. Gex says Noth Ghost. Yeah. No, you don't say that. I didn't hear you say it anyway. Do you break for Gex? Oh. That'd be funny. Alright, so back to base. We're going back to base. We're done with this system. It's been a good learning experience here. Back to base we go. Yes. It's not a freighter, that's a hauler. No, I'm gonna buy his zinc. I don't wanna kick his butt. sell some of these reward, these trophium bundles that I got. Yeah. 
Oh, look at all that. Nice. Oh, and the Crolium and the Lemium. Well, yeah, I'll sell them both. Sell them both. Starship, did you have Trophium also? No. Nope. Great, great. It's probably time to repair another slot, don't you reckon? I reckon. I'm gonna have to do that. Yeah, we're up over a million now. I could probably repair the rest of these slots if I wanted to get spendy. Huh. Let's go back to base and do our Spadonium business first. Oh, milestone accomplished. Nice. What is it this time? Merchant. 1.2 million units. Excellent. And away we go. You didn't land in that system, but that one planet. Yeah, well, that's all I needed there was the Spadonium. That's the only reason I went there. Robert Miles, I didn't need to land anywhere else. I love it. So easy. Yeah, land on the furthest planet and fight your way back to the space station. That's a good way to get pirate milestones. <laughs> to base to return all this spadonia. There we go, just upgrade updating the description. And somebody needed insulating gel. So that's what we've got to do. Where's Tamarium? Oh, inventory full. That's fine. There's the Tamarium. Oh, Tamarium doesn't go there. <laughs> there. Lots of iron, lots of thamium. There we go. Tamarium goes there. Along with the Spadonium. Along with the Mordite. There we go. And I need that so I can make an insulating gel. There it is. Excellent. Save the rest of that. Harvest the nip and the orb and the sack of venom so that everything's harvested. Fresh harvest in our little farm here. Sack venom, nip nip. That's what goes in there. And you know what? Let's do this right. Let's take that stuff out. Oh, can't yet. Hold on. Shoot. I messed up. I'll have to do that later. I was going to juggle that inventory, but never mind. Let's go give this guy his insulating gel. What was it, the builder? I think it's the builder. Nice. Right on, Link. Thanks for stopping by. Looks like I got the cash for some inventory slots now. Punchies? Yeah, that's what I was just thinking. Is uh, It's time to repair the ship a little bit more. Here you go. Insulating gel, Builder Gek. <laughs> he loves it. And now we can build the trade terminal with Voltaic cells and a bunch of other stuff. I should have looked at the ingredients. And that's the end of the Builder Gek, I believe. Yep. Boom. And for the Galactic Trade Terminal. There we go. Description updated. That guy's done. Let's check in the log. Right? Return to Builder. So when it says return to them, that means they're done. Now I just need Viridium and Rubium, which means I need, I need to start looking into Warp Drive Upgrades. 
That's going to be key now. I need to get warp drive upgrades taken care of. Ridiculous. But yeah. Oh, nice. It's good to have the builder finally done. That feels good. I feel accomplished. Let's reward ourselves. Look at this. 104,000 units to repair a slot on this Class B shuttle I found? Why, I'm going to repair it. Now what? 110,000. I'm going to repair it. And then what? 116,000. I'm going to repair it. And then 122,000. I'm going to repair it. 128,000 for the final slot on this 22 slot Class B shuttle. I'm going to repair it. That's it. 22 sh class shot slottle, uh, sh slot shuttle that I almost died for in that crater way back when. There's a stream highlight in the stream highlights playlist if you're so inclined to, uh, to watch that. But it was, a, it was, well, it was harrowing to say the least. My goodness, I almost died. I was nearly killed. I've got an extra resonator on deck in case I need that. I've got some Viking daggers I can trade here in my home base system. Only 46 nanites to my name, but that's okay. Nice. That feels real good. And what about my multi-tool? I probably deserve an upgrade in there too, don't I? Don't I? I wonder what technologies I know. I don't even remember. Man. My Class B rifle though. Ooh, yeah, I should give myself a few in here. 86,000. Repaired. 97,500. Repaired. 108,200. Repaired. There. And that leaves me with 428,000 units to my name, which I think is a pretty good number to hold on to for now. Seems pretty good to me. We got bolt caster, we got scanner. What is it going to take? Thamium, platinum, carbon to rebuild this? I could probably rebuild that right now, right? Where should I put my scanners, though? Uh, Maybe I won't worry about that for now just yet. But now I have some... Oh, what can I build? That's what I wanted to know. I've got three mining beam upgrades to build. That's great. And the blaze javelin that I could build. That's a base unit for a new weapon type. Don't know if I need to go there yet. Oh, what else? Wait, wait, wait. Lots more. I can increase my grenade intensity. That'd be nice. Yep. Um, yeah, some bolt caster upgrades that I've got as well. Grenade intensity and homing grenade for gold and aluminum. Wow. No more scanner stuff. But yeah, I could build the three plus ones on my mining beam. That might help things. That might help, and I can build them now. What do they cost? Iron, iridium, plutonium, iridium. Oh, there's something to use that iridium that I picked up on. Heck. Shall I? I think I shall. Treat yourself. Just got all this money and resources. I might as well spend it. Heck, it's permadeath mode. What are you going to do? Live forever? I'm out of heridium. Oh, no. I'm out of heridium. I need five more. Oh, wait. Do I have heridium stashed in one of my boxes, though? No, I've got platinum. I've got platinum stashed in this box. Yep. Hey, the life of Ryan, welcome to it. Storage slot price inflation in the future is insane, Noth Ghost? Yes. Yes, it is. Life of Ryan, you just missed that I got my uh, level 3 ship destruction milestone from fighting pirates just now here on permadeath mode. Feeling pretty accomplished. I just repaired the rest of my ship with the money I got from all those rewards. Plus, I finished the planet off. That was 250,000 units of glory. Oh, this has been a good stream. Oh, yes. I'm loving it. But, that being said, I am going to have to wrap it up there, unfortunately. Time to go. So thanks for joining me on this permadeath adventure tonight. It was very, very, very productive. Appreciate you guys being here. Hope you guys enjoyed it as well. Don't forget to hit that like button if you did. 
uh, and subscribe for more in the future. I like to play this. I like to play uh, some other games. I'll be playing Uncharted tonight for my regular stream time. I mentioned it earlier. I stream Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 9 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. So if you'll be around at that time, feel free to join me for some Uncharted 3 this evening. Uh, I'll be going at it with a gusto, trying to not die as many times as I can, but still dying a lot as Nathan Drake. <laughs> so feel free to join me for that. And if you guys want some more No Man's Sky right now, go ahead and check out Serious Gamer X. He is streaming right now. There's a link in the chat for you to follow. If you want to go say hey to Serious Gamer X, tell him Gaming Mike sent you. Let him know where you came from and be sure to spread that love over there. Hit his like button, subscribe. He's a great No Man's Sky streamer. His intros are the best. So I hope you guys enjoy that, and we'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.